Stan Wick Station, in western Arizona, was a stop on the Butterfield Overland Mail stagecoach line built in the later 1850s near the Gila River about 80 miles east of Yuma, Arizona. Originally the station was called Flapjack Ranch, later Grinnell's Ranch or Grinnell's Station. In 1862, Grinnell's was listed on the itinerary of the California Column in the same place as Stanwick's Ranch or Stanwick Station which became the site of the westernmost skirmish of the American Civil War. A traveler in 1864, John Ross Brown, said Grinnell's was six miles southwest of the hot springs of Agua Caliente, Arizona. Skirmish at Stanwick Station The westernmost skirmish of the American Civil War, which occurred at Stanwick Station, took place on March 29, 1862, when Captain William P. Calloway and a vanguard of 272 troops from the California Column discovered a small detachment of Confederates led by 2nd LT. John W. Swilling Burning Hay, which had been placed at Stanwick Station for the California Column's animals. After a brief exchange of gunfire with the much larger Union force, the Confederates retreated to Tucson, the capital of the Western District of the Confederate Territory of Arizona. The skirmish resulted in the wounding of a German-born Union private, William Frank Semmel Roger, who subsequently recovered. There appear to have been no other casualties. The significance of the incident was twofold. First, the burning of hay, not only at Stanwix but at five other former stagecoach stations along the Gila River east of Fort Yuma, delayed the California Column's advance to Tucson and Mesilla, the territorial capital of Confederate Arizona. Before the Confederates evacuated Tucson, they also removed or destroyed the supplies gathered for the Union advance by Ami S. White at the Maricopa villages. Secondly, and of more immediate importance, Swilling was able to reach Tucson and warn Captain Sherrod Hunter, District Military Commander of Western Confederate Arizona, of the approaching California Column. This led Hunter to place pickets at strategic locations, leading to the Battle of Picaccio Pass where ten Confederate pickets were attacked by a Union cavalry detachment of about twelve. This battle was also only a skirmish, distinguished from the Stanwix station fight simply by the comparatively more severe casualties, three dead and three wounded Union soldiers, and three Confederates taken prisoner. Stanwick Station The stagecoach lines were abandoned in the 1880s when the Southern Pacific Railroad completed laying track to Tucson from Yuma. The SPR built a station just to the east of the Maricopa County line on Stanwick's flats and called it Stanwick Station. 